Hi guys, it's Ashley, and today I have some stamping plates to review for y'all from BFB. They were kind enough to send these to me to review, and they sent me three stamping plates and their scraper. So I'm going to test them out today. And right off the bat, their scraper is probably the most flexible scraper that I have ever dealt with. It's even flexibler than my Born Pretty Store one, so I'm not sure how that'll work out, but we will see. So real quick, I am going to take these plates out of the packaging and I'll be right back. So I'm going to go over the smaller stamping plates first, and first is BBF34. And this one has a bunch of your lace flower designs on it, and it is very, very cute. These stamping plates are smaller than your normal stamping plates. They're about, they're, I think they're their mini plates. And as you can see, they're about the size of a credit card sized scraper. So there's that one. They do not come with a blue film on them. They just come in the plastic bags. And then here is BF49. And as you can see, this one has a bunch of your cutesy patterns. You got some lace roses here. You've got some geometric squares here. This kind of reminds me of like honeycomb. Then you have starred pattern. You have this flower pattern here. You have a abstract heart pattern here. And then you've got just this cool designs here. Then my favorite, favorite plate out of the group is this one right here. It even comes with a little shoe attached to it, which is so super cute. It is plate number BBF47, and I just adore it. I think that their fantasy plates are so cute. They have them all the way from Snow White to Ariel. So cute. And then this one is Cinderella. You have the two little mice here. You have the prince kissing Cinderella's hand. You have the glass slippers and then like a full nail design of the glass slippers. You have her running away from the castle. You have her and the prince in the carriage and some sparkles. You have her in her dress, her trying on the glass slipper, and then just a couple more images of her. Super, super cute images. So real quick, I'm going to test these stamping plates out and I will do some swatches.
and there are all the swatches. All in all, I'd have to say that I really, really love these plates. I love the images, especially the lace plate. I think it's my favorite. But the only critique I would have would be that the cotton gets caught in them whenever you're trying to clean them off. So you'd need like a lint-free uh, lint cotton swab to clean them off. Or something that doesn't have like a cotton ball that's going to get stuck in the grooves on the plates. But I hope you all enjoyed this video and as always, thanks for watching. Bye guys!